it's okay not to be okay. It sounds simple, but Mark DeBona, who retired from the Seminole County Sheriff's Office earlier this year, says dealing with depression and PTSD is certainly a team effort. You are never alone. There is somebody that will take you by the hands uh, and get you, guide you, and wherever you need to be to get healthy. I had the gun in my right. mouth. In your mouth. DeBono was on the Tamron Hall show recently, saying how his time pitching in at Ground Zero 18 years ago and how his day-to-day -day duties locally as a deputy? The baby died in my arms. I was doing CPR, and I, um, I felt so horrible, so guilty that I could not uh, bring the baby, uh, save the baby. Steered him to a full-time mission to save others, like he was saved on the night he had planned to end his life. It's okay to seek help. It's okay to be hurting, and you don't have to do it alone. Devona says it doesn't do any good to ignore problems, comparing it to a dull ache in your jaw. He says eventually, you're going to have to get your teeth fixed. His efforts to make mental health a priority for first responders got him a photo from President Donald Trump with a handwritten message of congratulations. If I touch one person uh, by me speaking out, uh, speaking about PTSD, uh, suicide, I, I, I've, I, I've, I've done my job. DeBona was saved when a fellow deputy pulled up next to him and talked him out of ending his life. He's paying it forward as part of the board of Blue Help. And we've got to show our first responders, you are not alone. I get it. I truly, truly get it. In Seminole County, Dave McDaniel, West 2 News. And he also serves on the board of BlueHelp.org, an organization specializing in mental health counseling and suicide prevention for first responders. If you or someone you know needs help, call the National Suicide Prevention Lifeline. That number is 1-800-273-8255.